The first product on our list is Mare's Trilastic. The Mare's Trilastic have thick, hard soles that keep your feet protected from sharp objects when walking in the shallows, making them a good choice for those who often begin their dives from the beach. They also transfer power from your foot to your fin effectively. The price is around $60, check out the product link in the YouTube description below. There are 5 customers have reviewed this product, the average rating is 3.6 stars, a customer said. Really good boots for kakaking hard bottom like a sneaker. An unhappy customer said. Great boot, but way too big. I wear a 12, and after returning the 12 and 11, am considering a 10 or 9. The second product is. Scuba Pro Unisex Delta. Whether you prefer them long or short, there is a Scuba Pro Unisex Delta for you. They come from a company owned by a PADI certified master instructor, so you can rest assured they have every feature you could want, like a gusseted zipper and fin retainer. The price is around $49, check out the product link in the YouTube description below. This product is rated with 4.2 stars from 42 customer reviews, a customer said. I needed some replacement boots. Scuba Pro to me is quality, there's the discount, and they're made in the USA. The style I selected works fine with my Scuba Pro fins and I chose the heavier version that is essential for shallow or shore dives where you may have to walk through rubble and sea urchins. Used them in the Virgins over Christmas and Cuba in January. I just got back from Bonaire where they really got a workout since we only did shore diving for a week. Great boots. Another happy customer said. I looked at a lot of boots, Mares, Aqua Lung and a couple of others and I selected this one as the best. The size is a bit bigger than expected once they can wet, but that's better than too tight. Nice fit otherwise and not too thick of a sole and not too thin. Just right. They came fast as usual from Amazon. An unhappy customer said. I bought these May 18, 2018. The plastic covering on the toes is already falling off becoming unglued. Two months and they're coming apart. I'm deeply disappointed. The next one is. Aqua Lung Super Zip Ergo. The Aqua Lung Super Zip Ergo offer most users a snug fit, so they should help to keep your feet warm, since they prevent excess water from sloshing around. Plus, their seams are placed away from the widest part of your foot to minimize the chances of abrasion. This product is available on Amazon for $51, check out the link in the YouTube description below. The next one is. Tusa Imprex. The Tusa Imprex have rubberized seals at the hems and gussets behind the zippers that do a good job of stopping water from gushing in. This ensures they keep your feet nice and warm, making them suitable for cooler climates. This product is available on Amazon for $59. The next one is. Neo Sport 3 Mega Meters. The Neo Sport 3 mm are affordably priced, yet have many of the same features as costlier models, such as a zipper locking Velcro strap. The soles are puncture resistant and provide a good amount of traction when walking on slippery boat decks. The price approximately $38. This product is rated with 4.5 stars from 1212 customer reviews, a customer said. I normally wear a bicycling socks and my Crocs sandals riding my jet ski. I bought a pair of this neoprene boot to compare if this boot is better for jet ski than my socked Crocs. So far when walking around the boat launch area, I prefer my Crocs. This boot has thin sole and I could feel sharp or high stone in the asphalt hitting up under my feet. I have to walk gently to not impact the bottom of my feet. The water gets inside the boots going to the water launching the jet ski. So far my feet prefer my quick drying cycling socks and Crocs sandals. But the Neo sandals is not too bad and does its intended job of keeping the feet relatively warm even when wet. 
Another happy customer said. We have had the opportunity to use these boots a couple of times now and we are very impressed. They are well made, durable, comfortable, protect your feet in the water, beach, and pavement back to the car. We used them the other day in the pool. While in the pool I pulled one of them off and was extremely surprised at the temperature difference. It was at least a 10 degree difference. They definitely keep your feet warm. One of the reviews I read before purchasing these boots stated that they are a bit snug when dry but once wet will stretch to fit comfortably. This is completely spot on. If you are looking for a good pair of neoprene boots we highly recommend these. An unhappy customer said. I wear these boots sometimes when I am working in rivers. They do keep my feet warm and protected, but they also let in quite a bit of water, which makes them heavy when I am walking, but that is a minor issue. My one real complaint is that the sole is thinner than other boots I've had, which makes walking over rocks a little uncomfortable. I have not used these with fins yet, but I can't see any reason why they wouldn't work perfectly. I would not recommend these if you know you will be walking in them, but if you are looking for a good budget set of boots for diving they will work for you. The next product is O'Neill Tropical. The O'Neill Tropical Sport is zipperless design, which some people like while others feel makes them a bit harder to slip on and take off. Glideskin seals on the lips not only minimize water intrusion, but also help to keep sand and small pebbles out. This product is available on Amazon for $46, check out the link in the YouTube description below. This product is rated with 4.3 stars from 62 customer reviews, a customer said. Just got these in the mail. I'm a size 11 in everything I wear, but these are very narrow near the toes and they put an uncomfortable of pressure on the outside front corner of my big toes. My wife normally wears a men's size 10 dive boot because she wears a 2 to 3 mm neoprene sock, she's actually a 10.5 women's size. These 11s fit her perfectly with the sock on, so she's keeping them and I'm going to order 12s and hope they break in a little. Quality and design is exactly what I wanted. Sole seems very grippy but shouldn't hold rocks, shells. Another happy customer said. Received this item with no problems as usual per Amazon Prime Shipping, nice low-cut boot, but not too low as to have your fin strap cause a problem slipping around. Nice traction on the bottom and seem to have plenty of reinforcement in heavy wear areas such as the heel and top of the foot where the fin rubs however I have not actually used this boot for anything other than test fitting because after reading the previous reviews I ordered a size larger expecting them to run small, they don't. I should have ordered my exact shoe size of a 12 which would have been perfect. I will probably reorder the correct size because these seem like nice boots and what I want but as for my experience and recommendation make sure you order your shoe size and you should be fine. I can't attest for the other sizing problems but from my experience scuba booties are supposed to be snug outside of the water because when you enter the water it becomes a functional wetsuit and expand a little with the water it traps next to your skin. Anyway, nice boot from what I can tell just be. Thanks for watching and hope you liked it. As always, all the links about the products will be in the description below, so if you want to find the best prices, and more information that we might not get a chance to mention in the video, be sure to check them out.